everybody, it is Dingle here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing super, super duper well. Guys, today I am excited because this is our very first fall 2019 clothing haul. I'm super pumped, but I'm even more pumped because I get to try out and review a very new, at least new to me, styling service. You all know that I am a pretty big fan of Stitch Fix. I stopped ordering their boxes after like my last box that I ever received from them just because I felt like they weren't on point and it was like the second box that they weren't on point for. But then I learned that the company like during that time was going through a lot of changes, like exciting ones for them. So super happy for them. However, I do miss the whole styling service type of thing. So when this company Fashion reached out to me and wanted me to review their stuff, their service, I said, of course, would love to. I want to be fully transparent with you. They are providing me credit for any of the items that I do keep, but you know me, I'm going to be honest. Just because they are giving me clothes does not mean that I'm going to lie about what I think about the clothes or anything like that. I do promise you that. One thing I will say about that though, that I really appreciate about Fashion versus other other brands that have reached out to me in the past is they didn't ask me to like put something on Instagram or like do a video in general. They just simply asked if I would review their service. So there wasn't this like pressure to make sure that I was saying anything nice or anything like that. Not that I would, but I just really appreciated how the brands like took their wording into consideration. Love that. But anyway, let's hop right into the clothes. But before we do, if you are new and are just seeing my face, hello, I am Mac Dingle, M-A-C-D-I-N-G-L-E. It's so nice to meet you. Make sure to hit the subscribe button before you leave and everybody if you like this type of content give this video a big thumbs up because it lets me know that you like it and let's get into the box of clothes that I have next to me right here so I did peek at the clothes but I have not tried them on whatsoever so that is something that we will do together live live right here with this video but I did put everything back exactly like how it came so just like stitch fix or any other services you get a box it's got branded tissue paper which is super cute they packaged it really nice nicely for me and as soon as you open it you get two things one you get something that tells you you're beautiful so thanks <laughs> and obviously they have all their socials on here you guys can check them out their Instagram is my fashion Facebook fashion Twitter my fashion and then within here is your invoice it just tells you the name of each product and the price of each and then this little card about like exactly what to do and what's next it literally says what's next First, we try on the clothes, see what we like, does it fit, does it not? And then it tells you if it's not quite the right fit, but if you like something, you can always exchange it, no cost to you. And then you can choose to check out with the items that you want to keep. You can save big on spending while you save rescue dogs. How flipping cute is that? Because for each fashion box they send, they donate a dollar to Second Chance Rescue NYC Dogs. That's so cute. They do have a bunch of different discounts depending on how many items you keep. If you decide to buy three or four items of your box, you get 25% off. And even better, if you purchase all five, you get 30% off. So that's really dope. I also know that your first styling session is completely free, no matter if you keep anything or return anything. But then after that, the styling session, like to actually send you the box and style you and all that stuff is $15. But if you keep anything, just one item or more from the box, that is waived just like Stitch Fix, which I really appreciated. So I think that's everything about the box itself. And then the last thing is just, it comes with this return slip, totally free to you. It has a prepaid thing on it. Oh, something really important about this service that I want to talk about just before we dive into the clothes is that you do a little quiz online, super easy, just like any other services you may have done in the past. And they take that and any special notes, you can give them your Instagram, your Pinterest, any like boutiques online or stores that you like to shop at. So just so they have everything like for reference. And then they curate a few items. I got seven total items that I could choose five from. So this is the first time that I've gotten a preview of my items items and gotten to choose the specific ones that I wanted in my box before they sent the box to me. So I loved that. At first I thought I wouldn't like that because I like the surprise of like opening the box to see what it is, but it actually made me like anticipate the box more to come to my house because I knew exactly what was in it. And I was like, oh, I can't wait to try on like that dress. That's so cute. So that's that. Anyway, let's dive into the actual clothes. So this first one is a maxi dress. It is, at first I thought it was black actually. This is a navy. I think it's navy now that I see it in the light, but it's a navy 
striped dress. Material is sturdy. That's how I would describe that. I'm very gap like, which I like Gap, so that's a good thing. And it's a maxi, so it looks like the top of it is spaghetti. I love this neckline here that usually looks pretty nice on me. And then you've got this cinch in here for some shape. And then at the bottom, at least in the picture, yes, it has a slit here. It's a little nice feminine touch to it. I'm going to try this on. I hope it fits really nicely. <laughs> this next one, oh, I was really excited about this one. Okay, in the picture it's a top by the way but in the picture it almost looks like shiny or like I don't know it's got this like like light giving off to it and I can see why because the stripes are very close together so I don't know if you guys can see but it makes it look a little bit like holographic like I don't really know it is very delicate but it doesn't mean that it's not a good quality item it's just something I wouldn't put in the wash but I can't wait to see how this fits all right the next item was kind of like I was going rogue away from like my usual style which by the way I told them I like things airy fluffy, flowy, just like not very fitted unless it's like jeans. I like my jeans fitted. It's just stuff that I can be comfy but kind of stylish in. And I told them that my favorite color was like pinks and corals, which I see a lot of in there. So I'm really pumped about that. But this item they threw in there because I'm sure they know that like it goes with a lot of this stuff. And I just realized that it's way cuter than I thought because this is the back of it. They showed me the back in the picture first. So I just assume this is the front. It's so cute. It's like this plain flow shirt and then on the back it's got this like surprise with these like wooden buttons really really cute actually really pumped to try that on so yay and then this one oh my gosh this is so cute again a very delicate fabric but really stretchy so I don't think I would put this at least in the dryer it's a little more baby pink than I usually go for but I do love the details on the sleeves they've got this thick ends to them like this detail here that's like pretty thick and the stripes go the other way and then they've got this tie I can see this working with skinny jeans and flats I can also see it working with some high-waisted shorts if you like want to tuck it in very cute sailor almost I can see myself like in my dreams on like a sailboat with like some cute high-waisted white shorts and this and then the last item is this cardigan because unfortunately it's cold today in Seattle like literally I I am an anti-fall person. Like, I will accept it eventually. But you guys know me, I am a summer individual. I love summer, and so when it starts to get fall and like the leaves start changing, I'm not one to get excited at first. I warm up to it and I have no choice. Like, I do, but I just get sad. But I do know that it's around the corner, so I did go for this cardigan that they suggested. The material is very stretchy. I do like the material just because I do have a cardigan like this. Not like this, but like very similar material from American Eagle. So so it's lasted me for years. The only thing, and it's not their fault at all, I just don't know if I feel good about this block design. It just might not be me. That's the only thing. But you never know, things look cuter on. So I think overall I'm impressed with the different things that I have. I think I even said that I really like stripes. So I have like three items with stripes in them. Which I'm really pumped about, but further ado guys, let's try these things on. So first up, I've got on that flowy top that has like these stripes that are pretty close together. I do like the sleeves. I didn't notice these until I put it on. These like little feminine details are super cute. I do like this and then how thick the sleeve is if you can see that. I love that it's like pretty flowy when it's just like this, but I prefer to tuck in my shirts. Well, now I can't because I just have one hand. I do like that look. And then I paired it with these just high-waisted skinnies. And I think I would wear some sort of like flat, like white flat with them. And it's super cute. I think the only thing that I'm sure of is how together these stripes are. It like makes my eyes not know or understand what the shirt is doing. I just don't know. It's just like the picture I was like, is that holographic? Is it shiny? I don't know. But yeah, I like it. I like it. Thumbs up for this one. All right, this was that wild card item for me. And I do remember that one of the wild card parts about it for me was the cap sleeves. My arms are just very athletic. And like, I like it. They don't seem it, but like I do gain muscle like very, very easily. Cap sleeves just normally don't fit around like my bicep very well, but I wanted to check out the color. But unfortunately, I just don't love the fit. I just don't think it's really doing anything for my body. And then the back, let's see if I can show you. I love that detail. That detail is so cute. It's just 
not fitting quite right for me. You can see a little bit of rollage with my bra there, and I do love, love the style. I think that's so cute, but even if I get like a size up, then it would just be like too big, you know? Just not my cut, not great for my body, so I'm gonna give this one a thumbs down, but there's plenty of extra good stuff in here, so let's move on. Okie dokie, next up is this cardigan, and I've paired it with just like a simple tank, like a simple cami that I had in my wardrobe, because that's probably what I would wear it with and I still have my jeans on. I think this is a really cute outfit. Honestly, I do love the cardigan, just not for me. Like there's nothing wrong about it. It's just not my style. I'm not a big block color person, I think. I've just never owned anything like that. I've never gravitated towards anything like that. Like if this cardigan was all this peach color, gorgeous, gorgeous. I just think these colors are a little bit darker and unmuted. And the fact that they go from like block, 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 it's just not what I would usually go for for myself. So I'm gonna give this one a thumbs down for me, but this could totally be someone else's style. It's just not for me. All right, I can't decide. <laughs> I think this is an adorable outfit. Like, I really like this, and I myself love pink. But this is not as flowy as, I don't know. Like, there's something just about it. It's either the pink or the fact that it's really stretchy across my body. It is comfortable. It's comfortable. I don't think it's that cute. Like, it's just, uh, I don't know. No, it's just like more form-fitting, I think, than, like, not more for, uh, I don't know. I'm not good at describing it. It's just a no for me. I think it fits fine. It's just not for me. Not for me. Okay, last but not least, we're gonna try on the thing that I think I'm most excited about. So I'm like hopeful, but I'm not gonna get my hopes up, you know? Let's, let's dive into that one. Okay. Okay, guys, I think it fits so well. Perfectly fitting across the top and it hides these little puppies that I got going on. So the fact that it goes like all the way across the top is super cute. I do love that it's cinched in right here. It's like more flattering in person than I think it is on camera actually. It makes me feel very long and I love this little portion of it. I'm gonna turn the camera this way just so you can see. This is what I'm like seeing full length in the mirror. I'm getting major like Athens Greece vibes and I'm obsessed with it. I don't know, something like like different to like having my wardrobe I think. I don't know, sometimes I like like it and sometimes I don't. I need you to comment down below if I should keep this. Please comment down below if I should keep this one. I might keep it, I don't know. I would love your opinion though. I think I'm just going to end the video here actually instead of set it back up on that tripod that you see. But guys, I wanna thank you all so much for watching. Please let me know what items you would have kept down below if you're like, girl, that looks great on you, you should have kept it. Or like, no, like send it back, like whatever. I'm very curious about what you think of this dress. I think it's cute, but now I'm second guessing it. Now that I look at it, it might not be that cute. I don't know, I'm very indecisive with this one. If I could just give my overall thought on fashion for a quick moment. I love what they're doing. I love the dog charity. I love that they are a startup. They're super small, they're super new. And I love supporting new startups like that. I think back to like what Stitch Fix probably started with, all of these other services out there, and they started just like fashion is starting now, which is super dope and I love supporting that. But I just think that the style of clothes that they have is just not me or they didn't send me that type of thing. I don't know, but just from this box, I just don't think they have my style of clothes, which is a very personal preference. The quality of everything was really nice. I think just the style of everything just like was not me. So I don't think I'll be keeping a lot of the items. But if you love the style, great. You know, like I would totally recommend them. They were so personable. The service was amazing. Uh, it felt very, very like catered to me and it was very easy. And I loved picking out my stuff that they picked out for me. It's just, a, it just comes down to the style for me. So if you all enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and let me know if there's any other boxes out there that you guys want to see me review. Happy to do it. I love you all so, so, so much and I'll catch you in my next one. I'll see you later. Bye.